Welcome to the Running Network Show. Join us each time as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great sport. Welcome to the USA Track and Field Club Cross Country Nationals. The men's race at the USATF Club Cross Country Nationals is just over and we found a couple of Michigan guys, one from Playmakers and one from Gazelle Sports. And we're all friends, right? Absolutely. <laughs> okay, and you are Chris Costin? Yep. And you are? Todd Falker. Todd Falker, of course. So tell us a little bit about the race today and then the course. It was a tough course. It ran faster than I thought it would, but we got out pretty quick time I saw a split how fast we were going but it was a lot of fun it was a great course honest but you know you could really get out and roll so it was fun and how about you Todd did you have a whole team or are you running as an individual um just ran unattached but I came with a couple guys from Kelvin and I went to Albion College so another Michigan rivalry up in so who won um <laughs> both the Michigan guys got me but I ran a PR as well so we all did well oh, wow. you won then too absolutely oh that's great that's cool so what did you think of the course um I thought there was was a lot of great competition. Um, it was really good. It was kind of hilly and rolling, but um, but you know, good traction, some long spikes, and just get out. Perfect weather day. We had a good time. Peter Ray from Zap Fitness, and I'm here on the course at Club Nationals 2009, and uh, we're getting ready to watch the leaders come by. Hopefully, it's someone from Zap Fitness. Well, who might be the the leader of that pack? What's his name? His name is David Jankowski, and he is running next to. I'm not sure who that is next to him. Someone from the New York Athletic Club. Okay. Well, we'll watch the show, and good luck on your team. Thank you. Yeah, this may be wrapped then. They're all there.
individual race and the team race for uh, the USATF Club Cross Country Nationals, David Jankowski. And David, you're very orange today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tell us about your race. Uh, well, the course is really a, one of a, a tougher, hard grind kind of course, which is a nice thing because that's that's really where we train in, in the mountains of North Carolina. So it was it was good to get a course that's a little bit more tough that that favored our team. So we we're pretty pumped about that. Uh, I was pretty impressed with with Josh Simpson's performance. I, I didn't expect him to be with me as long as he was. I, I tried to put in a move early, and he came right right with me, and that kind of scared me. I was I was pretty worried actually up until the last the home stretch that he was going to come and get me. But uh, yeah, no, it was good. And I think you came in sub 30, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, no, I think that's right. I'm not exactly sure of the time, but yeah, yeah. Well, it doesn't matter all that much on a cross-country course, but tell us a little bit about your team. You're getting to be a, a pretty well-known um, in terms of winning these races. Yeah, things are really coming along. I mean, we've got a good group of guys coming together, uh, especially our top three today. The other two are coming off injuries, which I'm impressed that they ran as well as they did, considering, I mean, Nick Polk was coming off a stress fracture, and uh, and uh, bleh, and Nate, Nate Peck was uh, coming off some iron deficiency problems. So, so it was good to see those guys run well too and just start coming back. Thomas is coming off some things too from the summer and it's it's really nice to see the guys finally working together and it's it's been a really great training group. Well, in terms of training groups, at one point you were with a marathon training group and now you're with a a group that focuses more on track and cross country. What are some of the differences? Um well, the main differences are just kind of the workouts. Uh the mileage is a little bit lower, and we do a, a little bit more fast stuff. So we get we get the legs moving a little bit quicker, which is a little bit more cohesive to track kind of races and things like that, which I feel are, are still my strength. I'm not quite ready to move to the marathon, and that's that's really where the reason I kind of switched groups was more so that than anything else. Well, you certainly came out a champion today. It's very exciting to see you at the front of the pack and then cross that finish line. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you very much. You're welcome. Very cool. Yeah. yeah.